It's a little past 11:15 uh, on the uh, 5th of June. We're about four miles out. Just had a heck of a hill to go by. And uh, just a little recap here. We've in the last five days we've gone 147. 0.5 miles. Mm -hmm. If we uh, get to Christiansburg today, it'll be uh, 188.5. Finally got some cyclists. It's about 11:10. Uh, I mean 11:15. It's the first cyclist I think we've seen since the day before yesterday. Uh, and that was the couple we saw at the um, at the uh, hostel and rural retreat. Just uh. One o'clock right on the button. We've gone probably seven miles so far. We got about a mile to go and we'll be turning. So you can see 81 just keeps going by us here. We're gonna cross under it in just a little bit. This is bit. Pulaski County. Uh, same Pulaski that I think his name's uh, lasted all over in Missouri too. So. Well, we're at the intersection of 654 and F044. Ellen's going to turn on the... That way, Ellen! It's 8 miles. It's uh, almost 1220. We're a little over 8 miles into the trip. We turned on that little bitty road. How are you feeling? Okay. Okay? Just goes up and down, up and down, man. Okay. And we're headed to Portland, Oregon. Portland, okay. That's the first time I've run to Portland. Seattle, uh, Astoria, what's that? Well, we'll, end up, we'll go through Astoria. Too. And you're going on. Back. Yeah, I see. Yeah. Well, where are you all from? I'm from Vermont. And your name? And I'm Jamie. Okay. I'm Heidi. I'm from up and down the East Coast. Okay, <laughs> up and down the East Coast. Okay. I'm back. I'm from Georgia. Georgia, huh? What possessed you all to do this? <laughs> hey, hey, hey. Got the camera on, huh? Yeah. Hey, yeah. Always. Hey, how are you? There's a car trying to get by. We can uh, let him. Alan, pull up just a hair. Pull up just a hair. There's a car here oh. trying to get. You guys are headed out towards the uh, Appalachians, huh? No. Well. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Going that way, right? Yeah, the mountains are that way. Vesuvius is. We came down. Hey, dude, that's a beast. Uh, that's a beast. Yeah, well, you didn't come to see that yet. Oh. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't get any better, actually. Can I have fun with that instead? Oh, yeah. Is it kind of downhill the rest of the way in the Daper? Draper? Yeah, I mean, it's, so far it's been kind of. Yeah. A lot of that, but we've been more climbing than down. I see. So, you guys got a cause? It's a card, big. Yeah. and it's and got uh, see a lot of poverty it's got the in, thing on the back of it. It's my YouTube. You know, We've got the movies you know, on there. Great. And what was your this group is, again? This is our card. Okay. It's the DC Area Books to Prisons Project. Okay. And there's a website here, and if you go to the website, it'll have a link okay. to my Facebook and pictures. Okay, but well, that's kind of what happens here. Hopefully. Number one, we didn't make much progress. We were just got done talking to the young uh, folks that were on their way out to Portland. I just thought I'd take this shot. This is a pretty typical thing to find a, these cemeteries all over the place out here, just kind of just out here. I guess you know, you know, bury people somewhere. And the terrain's kind of back to what it was uh, maybe 10 or 12 miles ago. Why don't you tell us who you are here, if you don't mind, and where you're from? We are Kaylin and Brad Smith, and we're from Warrensburg, Missouri. Warrensburg, and where did you start? We're heading to Astoria, Oregon. How did you get to Yorktown? Um, Brad's parents actually drove us 
things out, and then they spent a couple days vacationing. Well, it's pretty out yeah, there, yeah. That's beautiful. Yeah. Well, we've had people, you know, there was a man, what, from Colorado that started out there, you know, and I think he took, what did he say, he took a train, a bus, and some other things. You know, I'm not wow. sure how he carried his bike around, but he, yeah. but he did it. But, uh, yeah. yeah, you find a, actually, I'd say, what, we passed maybe about 40 people there? It's been a lot. I mean, it went for a long time with nothing, and then it's then it's it picked up. Yeah, you're, you guys are the first people we've seen yeah. coming this way. Yeah, we've been yeah, we're yeah like I said, it's about five minutes after, uh, or five minutes to two on uh, the 5th of June. It's, uh, <laughs> he said the hills are kind of up and down, but right now he's been coming up for quite a while, and he's got quite a little bump to go up here to get to the top, where we get to go down again. This is the town of Draper. Looks like there's quite a bit of renovation going on. I guess the, the trailhead there might bring uh, a number of people in. Country. Yeah, behind Ellen. He was coming out of here. We're getting kind of close to the bottom, but he was at 35. It's dropped down just a little bit now. Oh, it's our average coming down there. So it's uh, about 240. Uh, we just turned on the highway code 611 going into Newburgh. Well, it's uh, 10 after 3, we got about a mile down to where we turn on 626, I think it is, uh, and that'll make us only 17 and a half miles to go. Uh, I just met a gentleman that I was uh, chatting with that said that this is the original Wilderness Trail. There's one of the three the going west. Where they west the river down there, still had some of the structure there. And he was commenting about uh, one county over, Daniel Boone was an apprentice uh, hat maker, and he still got a warrant out because he skipped on a note. Uh, yeah, I mean, it, you know, it's very deceptive. They didn't look like much hills on the map compared to some of them we've been on, but I think they were worse. Yeah, you know, I recognized that the other day because it says on the map that these only show elevations big enough to show on the map. Right. So they had to be big elevations. Yeah, they're that So all the way through here, it's just going to be that way, all the way to Vesuvius, well, which is fine. I was thinking today, as 